Hey everybody, welcome to the channel, Taking the Bathroom. The bathroom is the only place where you can place your gadgets in peace. So on this channel, we do product reviews and also some tutorials. If you want to support the channel, check out my ebook, www.managesetthemselfonfire.com. Also have a PayPal donation link in the description of the video. All right, so we still own it talking about how you can become your own boss and how you can sell internet and cable. Primarily, I've been talking about the hotspots, how it's truly unlimited data and how it can benefit you and your family members or your friends and neighbors. Yesterday, I did a video showing you guys how you can get a proper IME number. And you know I have that video, 20 minute long video, $25 donation. Only thing you have to do, people, send me your email along with the $25 donation, whether it be PayPal or whether it be um, Cash App, the Bogan 78. All of the information will be in the description of this video. The reason why that video is so important is that it spells out everything, all the information in one place, how to buy a hotspot, which hotspots work, how to purchase the hotspot, the secret website you have to buy from. You can't just go to 1810 and get it. You have to go to that secret website to get truly unlimited internet. All of the information is included in that video. And guys, I try to answer questions that you have or that that you may have so you got a hot spot and you're like all right tech i brought the video i got a hot spot i put my sim card in there and it's not working what's the problem now if you're anything like me i know some of you guys out there you're taking the cheat way out you're getting a reused um hot spot or amazon call it a renewed hot spot so when you plug that up guys sometimes you might have some issues with the apn and so i want to do this quick video to show you exactly how you can get into your apn and i want to use the velocity Velocity 2. So one of the things I always tell you guys about the ZTE Velocity 2 is that it is a great device. You know, I'm a MiFi guy or MiFi guy, whatever the pronunciation you want to go with. Both of them are great devices. Also the at and home base. All the information in the video. I'm giving you guys way too much, way too much. But one of the things you want to do when you get it, you want to go ahead and turn it on. Now, you put a SIM card in there and you're going to see, if you go to Wi-Fi and you scroll over, you're going to see the website. It's going to be the at and uh, Wi-Fi manager and it's going to have a default code. What you want to do, you want to log on to the device, wherever the Wi-Fi code is, log on, connect to the Wi-Fi, then go to the browser and put in the at and uh, manager link that you find on the device. Once you go into the link, you log into the device and I'm going to show you exactly what you have to do from there. All right, so here we are, at and Wi-Fi manager. You want to go ahead and you want to put in the code. I'm going to blur this out. The default code, guys, is at and admin, but I changed mine. All right, you log in here. You can see I have my main passwords blurred out. You log in here, just what you're going to be greeted with. So you can see that this device, you can have up to 10 devices connected to the Mi 5 15. The 18th home base is 20, I believe. And you can go ahead and you can toggle between 0.4 gigahertz or 5 gigahertz. I just want to just go over these settings briefly. This is not what you need to know, but I just want to show you what I have in here. So you go to settings, you can see Wi Fi, you can change your passwords, etc., etc., etc. You go to um, advanced settings and you can go and you can have a little bit more control over the bandwidth, the frequencies. If you are technical savvy, you can mess around with the settings up in here. You go to firewall, you can go to advanced again and you can change your administrator um, settings. That's how you log into the site. But what we want to be, we want to be right here to network. You can go right here to connections. You can turn it off and on. I mean, you can turn your mobile data off and on from right here. You can check your signal strength, the grand kebab, where we want to be, the APN setting. This is the number one factor for most of you. Find a hotspot, putting an active SIM card in there and it's not working. When I come right here, to the APN settings and you see right here I have it named profile selection AT&T broadband and I went ahead and I named my APN broadband those are the only things you need to fill out is the name and the APN now when you come right here you want to go ahead and go to add and then you want to put in AT&T broadband you name it and then just put in broadband now another one if that don't work or sometimes if you want a little faster speeds now nah, it worked for me in the past it might not work for all of you I come right here guys and I put AT&T and then 
then I put in, is it next gen? I put in next gen and that usually work, give me a little fast speeds. But for the, the most part, it's gonna be AT&T broadband. So if your hotspot is not working and you have an issue with your hotspot that you just bought, probably renewed, AKA used, what you wanna do is log into the device. You wanna go into your networks and you wanna find your APN and you wanna add a new APN. And then after you add it, you wanna set it as your default. Now what I do after I set it as my default, I delete the other one. That way, if I um, make a mistake and reset the device, the device don't get confused and it don't read log Log on to that um, APN. It shouldn't, but hey, anything can happen. So there you have it. The Velocity 2 setting our APN number. When you get a hot spot and it's not working, it's one of the ways you can troubleshoot. Or you can check your IME number. Make sure that you troubleshoot. Don't give up, guys. You heard one of my subscribers, Nate, say that he went from paying $120 a month just for internet to paying $35. Now, imagine if you can take that, you sell that to your neighbor. Your neighbor paying $120 a month. You say, hey, man, I got a device. Double your money. I sell it to you for $65 a month. And if you sell IPTV, double agent, link in the description of the video, you can go ahead and you can sell them IPTV with it. For $70, you can give your neighbors internet and cable. You can't beat it. This is how you troubleshoot changing your APN on a hotspot. Truly unlimited data. It's your boy taking the bathroom. Until next time. Peace. Hey, get the video, guys. Cash app, dbogan78 or PayPal me. The description will be in the video. It's going to show you exactly how you can start selling this or how you can start saving yourself some money. Until next time, don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace. Giving you guys the game. God. Oh man, what I gotta do? Tap dance? Don't forget to subscribe and also hit that notification button so you can be up to date with all of my latest videos.